2021 is just around the corner. We have 53 days from today till we have 2021. And that means we are going to reflect on 2020. We are going to set new New Year's resolutions, new goals, and it's really, really exciting. But I believe that waiting till the 1st of January might be a little bit dangerous, especially if you did not reach your goals that you set up in January 2020. Because, you know, if you didn't reach your goals, you might be then thinking on the 1st of January, why should I set up goals for next year? Why should I think about new New Year's resolutions if I didn't manage my previous ones? Well, don't worry, 2020 still can be saved. Hi, it's Marina. Welcome to Tuesday's Action series of short videos where I share with you always one actionable step you can take right at that moment that's going to lead to a more productive and meaningful life. If you're new, consider subscribing. Today's Tuesday's action is for those who had ambitious goals for 2020 and then life happened. And you might feel really discouraged to actually plan for the next year. So for today's Tuesday's action, I want you to sit down and think about your goals for 2020. What were your goals? What did you reach? What did you not reach? What were the reasons that you did not reach the goal? And I want you to treat it as a researcher treats their data. I want you to be objective. I don't want you to blame anyone, whether it's someone else or yourself or the circumstances. You know, just treat it as data. Just collect the data and learn from it. And after you do that, I want you to come up with a plan for the rest of 2020. There is still more than 50 days left. That's a really a lot. You can achieve a lot in 50 days. And yes, if you wanted to lose 20 kilos in 2020, you might not be able to reach that in the 50 days that are left, but you might be able to lose two kilos. So I want you to come up with the plan, with the goal, and then how you're going to achieve that goal. So you might be thinking um, eating a bowl of veggies with every food, not taking a lift, but the stairs, going with your dog for one hour walk every single day. And not only that you don't have to wait to start working on your goals in 2021, if you are going to use those last two months of 2020, you are actually going to have this momentum that's going to carry over to 2021 so that when you set a new resolutions for this new year, you are not going to become one of those people that set ambitious resolutions in January and then when February comes they don't even remember what those resolutions were. No, you will have this successful two months because you know you can do something for two months that doesn't sound so scary. You can now work on your goal for two months and then use this momentum and get a really great start in 2021 and achieve your goals in 2021. Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe if you are new and like this video if you enjoyed it. I will see you next time.